hi welcome back to my youtube channel in this video how can we simplify this without using calculator so let's have it to be solution so from here let us note that we can have 27 as 9 times 3 we can also have 32 as the product of 16 times 2 then we can also have 18 as the product of 9 times 2 then let's now substitute everything here and see how to solve it so we're going to have roots of 9 times 3 plus root of 16 times 2 over roots of 9 times 2. So then let us recall that when we have root of a times b equals as root of a plus root of b. So from here we have this to be roots of 9 times root of 3 plus root of 16 times root of 2 over root of 9 times root of 2. Then from here we have roots we can have 9 as perfect square 3 to the power of 2 times root of 3 plus we can have 16 as perfect square 4 to the power of 2 times root of 2 over here 9 in perfect square as 3 to the power of 2 times root 2 then when we have square and square root they normally cancel each other so this will cancel this this will cancel this this will cancel this so we are going to have 3 times root 3 plus 4 times root 2 over 3 times root 2 so from here we have td root td plus 4 root 2 over td root 2. So at this point we can do something reasonable with this. Let's try to conjugate this. So what we mean by the conjugate is that look at this denominator. We have to multiply it here, both at numerator and denominator. We are going to repeat this. So that's what we mean by conjugate. So to conjugate this, meaning we are going to have this 3 multiplied by 2 at the top here, divided by 3 multiplied by 2. So now looking at this, 3 root 2 divided by 3 root 2 will be 1. So it has nothing to do with this. So now let's have this as from here 3 multiplied by root 2 that we have here multiplied by the whole of this 3 multiplied by root 3 plus 4 multiplied by root 2. So we have to close this over this 3 times 3 we have it here will be 9 times root 2 times root 2. So from here we have 3 times this 3 will be 3 square times 2 root 2 times root 3 plus this 3 times this will be 12 times root 2 times root 2 then 
over 90 when we have root a times root a equals root a square so from here we are going to have 9 times root 2 square so from here this again we construct this then we are going to have this to be 9 times root 2 times 3 plus 12 multiplied by this will be 2 to the power of 2 over this guy here will be 9 times 2 so we have this as root 9 multiplied by root 2 times 3 will give us 6 plus 12 multiply by this we also cancel this so we are going to have 12 times 2 then over 9 times 2 will give us 18 so from here we have 9 multiply by root 6 plus 12 times 2 we give us 24 over 18 so what is coming here between this this and this i think um 3 is common so from here 3 is common here 3 is also common here when we factor 3 outside 9 divided by 3 here will be 3 times root 6 24 divided by 3 here will be here will be 8 over 18 so we have 3 into 3 multiplied by root 6 plus 8 over from here we can have 18 as the product of 3 times 6 so this guy here can cancel out this guy so we are going to have this as 3 multiplied by root 6 plus 8 over 6 and this is final answer for the value of the expression so therefore we have root of 27 plus root of 32 over root of 18 to be equals 3 multiplied by root 6 plus 8 over 6. So if you are new here and find it really interesting, don't forget to share, like, comment, and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more tutorial videos.